A proud day today for the Cincinnati Fire Department and one of the department's new lieutenants in particular. Richard Childs has the story from Oakley tonight where a new woman is in charge. Cincinnati Fire Department breaking new ground today but continuing a proud tradition of leadership. Going to work today, it kind of kicked in. Your, your role and responsibility is different now. In her 15 years as a Cincinnati firefighter, Valencia Fraser has faced danger head on. Today marks a new challenge. She is in charge of Engine Company 31, the first African American woman to command one of the companies. I'm now making decisions um, versus as a firefighter, I'm following the decisions of my lieutenants. In her career, she's experienced the pain and the pride of the profession. Losing classmate Oscar Armstrong in a Bond Hill fire, one of her hardest days. Today, one of her proudest. Doing the routine things well is what she'll probably command from her people. And uh, she has my full support. When the lights and sirens come on and lives are at stake, those she commands say only Lieutenant Frazier's abilities matter. I'm in a non traditional job that is becoming, hopefully, a traditional job for women as the, as the years go by. Now, Lieutenant Frazier says that silver bar in her collar doesn't mean the end of her climb on the promotional ladder. She says it's just a rung in her career that she intends to climb. In Oakley, Richard Childs, WLWT News 5. Lieutenant Frazier's husband and brother also serve with the Cincinnati Fire Department, and her husband was also promoted today. So, congratulations to both of them.